Well, good morning and welcome to our devotion time. If you were able to join in with the uh, Bible study last week in Matthew 24, you'll run across this verse. And it's a verse where uh, folks had come to Jesus and uh, his disciples and asked uh, about the end times. And uh, part of that, uh, uh, his comments on that was, uh, in uh, Matthew 24 was, a uh, nation will rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom. And I had suggested as a part of that, um, the nations uh, in the original language had more to do with um, not boundaries for countries, that was more kingdom, but uh, had to do with uh, ethnicity, with people. And so um, it, it, people groups, uh, and, and nowadays we call them maybe sometimes uh, special interest groups. And I think this passage is quite uh, pertinent for uh, this week as we see riots going out across the, the land for the uh, uh, the police brutality that happened in Minnesota. And obviously we can all say that that was a, just a horrendous thing that, that happened there. And we certainly want to pray for the family and the people who are hurting so bad. And, and we hear this word racism uh, lifted up so much here this week and then uh, now a lot of uh, anger, a lot of riots that are going on across the nation and um, uh, what uh, some in the media are calling a protest because of the uh, senseless uh, uh, brutality. But um, I would say, uh, this is your pastor talking, that uh, it goes a little bit deeper. It's kind of like um, uh, I remember one time in my flower bed, I had a, a tree growing up out of the flower bed and I cut the tree down and thought that was the end of it. But lo and behold, it, it came up again. And it took me getting a little bit deeper and going after the roots in order to get that tree out of the flower bed. And I, I tell you that to say, I think things are a little bit deeper. Uh, racism uh, in my opinion, it's just my opinion, is a, a fruit of something uh, much deeper. And it's sin. Um, that uh, sin causes um, just all types of brokenness. You know, uh, and, and our nation needs God. Our nation needs to find freedom in Christ. Our nation needs the grace of Jesus Christ. I think uh, that should be our prayer this week. So God help us to obviously combat racism in our nation. But let's get to the root of this. Help us to overcome sin. And we plead for the mercy of our nation and, of course, of ourselves, that God would free us from uh, hatred, bitterness, the roots of, uh, of racism, which are sin. Well, I pray that um, your prayer time will be a good one uh, this week, and uh, let's end in prayer. Father, I thank you for America, and I thank you for uh, the history where we say all men, all persons are created equal under your sight. And we pray that that certainly would be so, that you would... Uh, through your grace, rip up the roots of bitterness that are in the hearts of the people of this nation, and that you would plant instead uh, roots of forgiveness, of salvation. We thank you that you are here. We thank you that um, you control our nation. Have mercy on us, and it is in Christ's name we pray. Amen. All right, have a great week. Talk to you soon. Blessings.